already there are too many kids and still more come in. The, well, like the library, it doesn't have so many books like it should. should. Schools I've been before had a lot more books than this one. I can't get any help at home because my mother talks Spanish and I can't get any help there. It has to be from the school. And they don't get much there either. Well, the motivation is to make them see that there is, there is something uh, else to life than being out in the streets and, and uh, joining uh, teen gangs uh, or, or getting into drug addiction, that there is a possibility that they may be able to find something better in life other than that. So we try to go along these lines, uh, educate them, orientate them here to finish academy so that they could feel more motivated for finishing their, their school. Let George do it used to be the American watchword. The only catch was George seldom did it. Gradually, groups of people began to adopt a new watchword. If you want something done right, do it yourself. On Chicago's south side, Operation Breadbasket became almost a prototype of self-help groups. Organized as an arm of the Southern Christian Leadership Conference, Breadbasket aims at green power. Its major goal, business success for an oppressed minority in a world where success is measured in economic terms. COCO, the Kenwood Oakland Community Organization, showed the city what an organized community group can accomplish when it unites to fight for common goals. These and other black groups arose and continue to arise from a single source, people who tired of waiting for someone else to do something for them and decided to do it for themselves. As black Americans make their long, slow climb and following other minority groups up the ladder toward the American dream, still other groups struggle for a toehold on that ladder. American Indians, Mexican Americans, Puerto Ricans. Slowly, they each make the same painful discovery. If you want something done, don't wait for the Bureau of Indian Affairs or the Welfare Office or the Alderman to do it for you. Don't wait for the establishment. Do it yourself. The first step is to organize. The next is to be noticed. Recently, a short film was produced designed to demonstrate that Puerto Ricans are making the moves needed to cope with their problems. Their instrument, people power. Here is that film. Nosotros los puertorriqueños nos hemos determinado a desarrollar una mejor comunidad para el bienestar de nuestros hijos. The promotion and development of programs that will bring about positive changes in the private and public agency is the primary concern of the Puerto Rican Conference.
papers and your wig hat on your head. Well, I'm pretty sure, sweet darling. I'm really pretty sure, am I? You're gonna really knock 'em dead.